When it debuted a couple of years ago, the True North Concepts MHA, or Modular Holster Adapter, took off like a rocket by consolidating a number of different holster mounting features and preferences into a single platform it proved incredibly popular with both professional and civilian shooters alike. However, the one consistent complaint that both True North Concepts and us heard about this, and the reason we heard about it is because everybody was asking us to build this, the Icefence Classic Holster Pad. And the reason for that is that the one complaint people had is that the sturdy aluminum construction created a little bit of a hot spot, especially if you use the leg strap adapter. So in this video, we're going to show you how to make that hot spot disappear. Let's get started. So this is how your Ice Fence Classic holster pad is going to come, just in this little clear bag like this. Uh, you're going to get a hang tag, and uh, if you looked at the hang tag, you saw the flip side has a QR code, which is probably how you found this video. Then you're going to see there's a section of one wrap on the other side, and then your Ice Fence Classic holster pad. Don't forget, this has stickers on it. Um, then what you're going to do is take uh, those items out, and then you're going to strip down and assemble your True North Concepts MHA like this. I've gone ahead and loosened each of these three mounting screws, uh, to speed up the install on this video and also to make it a little bit easier. So we're going to have to thread this one wrap underneath the T-bar like so after you've loosened the screws and then you kind of slide it down just about to where these holes are and you'll see why we're going to do that in a second. And then you want to bias the one wrap kind of heavily about three quarters to one side and we'll show you why you need to do that in a minute. Once you have all those things lined up, you have your QLS fork in the position that you want it. You grab your Allen key and then you go ahead and tighten it down again to make sure that it's secure. With that tightened up, then you take your Ice Fence Classic Holster Pad and you're going to drop it in. This is where you have the opportunity to do one optional step, which is where you can put the adhesive hook pad that we include in your package here if you want, after you swab it with some alcohol briefly, if you want a little bit of extra security, but you by no means absolutely have to have it. That's literally it. Hotspot gone. Uh, hope that was helpful, guys. Uh, if you guys have any questions, drop them in the comments below. You know we're really responsive, or you can drop us an email, info at Core Performance. Uh, now I'm going to ask you to do that cool YouTube stuff where you like, comment, subscribe, and make sure you turn on those notifications, because I think only 80% of you or 80% of you guys are not subscribed. So that's all we've got for today, and we'll catch you guys next time. Stay frosty.